What's up? What is up, my friends, and welcome to the hottest damn show on the internet. Sorry about it, Sorgi. I, I hit it too hard. Let me. We want to try again? No, no, you're it's fine. Talking mayhem mania, and uh, I'm I'm your pal in your mainstream media. I should be packing my suitcase, but I'm not. Uh, I'm here with uh, I'm here with Billy. Is that Billy? Hey, Matt. How you doing? And uh, joining us, uh, Tina from the West Coast. What's <laughs> up, Tina? Um, so first question, you know what, let me, no, what, you know what, let, let's talk about what we got here on our super card for Mayhem Mania. We just had Patreon in the bank. Uh, it was a hot mess, but, uh, here's what we got on the super card. Um, Ricochet versus Pete Dunn, Elias versus The Rock. We've got the Bludgeon Brothers versus the Authors of Pain and Hell in a Cell. We've got Joe versus Lesnar. Um, we finally got Bobby's match, the iconic duo versus Sailor Moon onto the super card. We got Finn Balor versus Aleister Black, buried alive. And thanks to Bo Diggity, Battle of the Network stars, hair versus hair. Alexa Bliss, Nia Jax, Bailey, and Sasha Banks versus Charlotte, Carmella, Natalia, and Becky Lynch. That's seven. Um, okay, Tina, to start with you, how did we do? Um, um, it, it's a pretty eclectic card. But what I've noticed, there is only, I want to say, one champion in that super card of the, out of all of them. Well, Pete Dunn's on here, too. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Pete well, Dunn's the, I think Pete Dunn's Brock. the only current. Oh, and Brock. Okay. But, yes, point taken. That um, Yeah, lack of champions on there. Well, Amber Moon as well, too. But Well, I, I think. I think the greater point is, and this seems to always happen during Mayhem Mania, is that uh, inevitably we're always looking for the next thing because we are not satisfied with what we have right now. So that mm -hmm. seems to always be where this thing goes. Is <laughs> where <laughs> where is the next wave coming from? And I think, um, you know, I think uh, the results here show there's a lot of enthusiasm for, you know, the NXT guys, you know, and guys who maybe haven't had their shot like Elias and um, Joe, um, guys on the main card like that. So, uh, it, eclectic is a very good description of this card. I definitely agree with that. Billy, how do you think we did? I think we did pretty good. I, I mean, I mean, it was not looking good. It was looking grim there a couple of weeks ago. Yeah, it was actually, it was like last when I pulled in this morning or this evening, I looked at it. It's like, wow, we got a lot of work to do, but I think we got a lot done. We did. And, uh, I would be remiss if I didn't, uh, thank Larry for donating an entire stack of post-it notes so that we could do patreon in the bank tonight and in return for one night only we are referring to this as the bart gun memorial mayhem mania but tomorrow and then we'll, this will be forgotten and we will never speak of it again okay and the internet is forever he, he's got video proof now he's leaving <laughs> Um, there, there are eight matches on the undercard. We're going to put those on uh, the Facebook group uh, on the Wrestling Mayhem Show. We are going to let you vote, and you will decide the eighth match on the Mayhem Mania card, and then we will compare it to past years, and we will laugh. Um, Sorg, a long time ago, many weeks ago, when we began this journey, um, I realized that um, I don't get to create matches uh, for Mayhem Mania, and that's okay by me because it's... It's uh, it's enough to uh, keep myself busy just to uh, try to control this mess. Um, but uh, there was one match that jumped into my brain uh, the moment we began this journey, and I was curious if anyone would be able to guess what my dream match was for Mayhem Mania this year. The match I would create first and foremost above all others. And um, well, no one, uh, no one got it before tonight. There was a big bounty on it that won't be collected. Too bad. I guess we'll try it again next year. Uh, does anyone want to take a last minute guess on what my dream match is? Just while we're sitting here, real quick, Billy, Tina. I would have no idea. No, Tina. Any? Okay. Uh, Sorg, you've probably no. been closer to this than any of us, so no guess. All right. Well, I hope I don't embarrass myself. This has been like two and a half months of hype for this dream match, so I hope everyone feels like it pays off nicely. So, Sorg, let's rip over the envelope and let's show everyone what my dream match was for Mayhem Mania. This the year. envelope, please. <laughs> I hope it's the one I remember writing down. It's, all right. it's empty. <laughs> His podcast rates. Yes, that's right. Well, you got to go with what you have handy. 
Did you, did you like it? Yeah. It Ooh. was Nakamura versus Alistair Black. A, uh, and uh, a, a battle of pure strikers, right? So you'd see a lot of lot of feet, a lot of knees, a lot of striking. I thought it'd be I think it'd be freaking awesome. Um so uh, I hope some of you agree with me that this would have been an awesome that, match. That I'm been, sorry that it's not a Mayhem great. Mania. I'm glad you think so. I can't believe Nakamura wasn't even mentioned. Nakamura was almost not mentioned at all. Who else was I trying to think about guys who weren't mentioned at all? The Miz was not mentioned once until tonight. The Miz finally got mentioned. Um and uh yeah, there's a bunch of other guys who barely gone out. Like we, we we had Seth Rollins on early and Seth was never spoken of again, I think, after that, and Rowan was on early and, and he was never spoken of again. A lot of guys got <laughs> the eliminators tonight were hilarious because people were just like going for like what top talent can we get off of this card at all costs? So we got Cena, Undertaker, Orton. It was just they were just jettisoning by people left and right from there. Um but I mean I don't know what else to say, sorry. I mean, it's been another fun year. Um, I needed a little bit more support than usual because, <laughs> you know, I got, got a lot on my plate, but, um, I thank everyone who, uh, helped out along the way. Uh, Missy took the reins one week and Chad, the shed, uh, was a big help. He probably hosts this thing better than I do. Um, which is, uh, always fun. It's too bad. He's not here tonight to, uh, be part of the ending, but, um, uh, and I thank everyone for helping out and all the patrons who are uh, throwing their money and support Sorgatron Media. And uh, I hope you uh, found tonight a worthwhile reward for your uh, for your support of Sorgatron Media because uh, it is a bit of a car crash, especially tonight. But uh, um, I had fun. Sorg, did you have fun? It's a blast as always. Billy, did you have fun? Absolutely. I'm I'm glad I was in studio this year. The last yeah, year me I too. could make it thing that still uh brings the, the the namesake of mayhem to the show yeah and i also like the fact that this is the fourth year we've done it and uh, i still struggle to explain it to new people exactly what it's supposed to be <laughs> it's always nice to have a newbie here so i could try to explain it to them in a new way but uh inevitably it, it never makes any sense yes. so um so that's it i gotta go home i gotta pack a suitcase <laughs> uh me and my wife and Mad Mike are going to be traveling to New Orleans. And uh, you know what's going to be happening in New Orleans. We're going to be taking part in some of that. Um, and I would um, advise our, our many fans and our many uh, friends out there in the internet to uh, stay tuned to all your Sorgatron Media and Wrestling Mayhem Show media, social media channels for all the uh, fun and antics that we get into while we're uh, making our way down to New Orleans. And uh, we're going to be down there for a solid week. A week! A week! Of wrestling and other things. And uh, and sleep. And sleep. I hope Jen's got plenty of bail money for you and Mike. Oh, my goodness. And um, uh, we're going to see if we can find some interest. Hey, if we run into you down there, I know there's some uh, friends of the show who are going to be down there. I know there's some uh, uh, people who watch the show. Um, some of the Mayhemers were in the chat room tonight saying they're going to be down there. So a please try friends, to. A lot of friends of the show are going to be on cards. Yeah, I'm going to be on cards. So we, hopefully we run into you guys. Hopefully we get to see you in action. I know I'll definitely be seeing uh, DJZ in action on the Lucha <laughs> versus <laughs> Impact Wrestling. Oh my goodness, Mad Mike is there. And Mike is going to be hot, hot, hot down in NOLA. So it's going to be great. I've packed every wrestling shirt that I own. Um, I'm kind of wondering if that's too far. Like, should you take every piece of wrestling merch you have? Or is this like wearing the t-shirt of the band you're going to see? No? We're good? Okay. So I'll be taking my Kevin Owens shirt, shorts and my uh, Kenny Omega socks. You're just going to have a Kevin Owens And my Owens Dario day. Cueto t-shirt. <laughs> and my Nexus t-shirt. <laughs> and my Bad News Barrett t-shirt. And my King Barrett t-shirt. And uh, and whatever other Wade Barrett merchandise I have in my possession still. And I'm... Uh, Man, wouldn't that be great if I see Wade down there? You you should wear it um, Saturday night in case he's the surprise comeback like Drew McIntyre was before. Oh, to um, to NXT. To NXT. Yeah, they cut away to me, and I'll be the one like crying in the stands. <laughs> oh, thank you. There's no like obvious new person to sit in the crowd at that takeover show, yeah. is there? You'd be surprised. Maybe it will be a big. Oh, it's gonna be out of the blue if they do something. All right. Well, hey, thanks for watching. Thanks for being part of Mayhem Mania this year. Check out WrestlingMayhemShow.com if you want to find out how we got to this place. It was a long, rugged road this year, but it was a lot of fun. I was happy to do it and happy uh, that Sorg lets me do it. And uh, thanks for watching and uh, talking Mayhem Mania. And uh, we'll see you around the bend. Enjoy WrestleMania. Enjoy NOLA. And uh, good night, everybody. This 
This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.